Good afternoon, fellow personalization specialists. This is Lori Champagne with another how-to tip for engraving. Today, I have a $100 bottle of champagne that I'm going to be lasering and sandblasting. As you can see from the layout that I've created here on paper, the customer wants three logos and some text on the bottom, and then a bunch of text on the curved top, which is always a difficult place to Put engraving. I've already laid the film coming down on the easy part and now I'll show you how to stretch film to make it fit around the top. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to just start the carrier sheet a little bit. It'll help me out later. I'm going to lay down the film so it's just barely overlapping the bottom piece and then I'm going to work in just a straight line going up. Next, I'm going to peel back the carrier sheet. Now, this particular film is a little bit on the brittle side. So in order to help that, I have a heat gun. And I'm just going to heat up the film for just about three seconds. And then I'm going to pull and shape. And if it starts to feel brittle again, Hit it with a little bit more heat and continue to pull and shape. Okay. Turn it around and we'll do the same thing to the other side. Oops. You don't want to hit the heat gun too much or the whole thing will just start pulling apart. Okay. There we go. Now, so you might be able to see right here I've got a little bit of a bump in the film there, okay? So I'm just going to take the heat gun to it once more, just a little bit, and just press that out. Now, if there's a little bit of a line, that's okay. The laser should be able to handle that. But you can try once more if you want. And this time I'm going to use my fingernail and just smoothen over the top. There we go, that did the trick, okay? One more hit here, and we're all set. Now it's ready to go into the laser. Thank you, and always remember, never stop creating.